come to this absolutely amazing day, this day of tremendous accomplishment by so many of you. When we set out to do this project, we were honored to be in the Solar Decathlon, but we really wanted to change housing and the way housing was done. Having come to the competition several times over the years, it always seemed to me that it was a shame that the houses packed up and left. And so we decided they should stay. And that's what we did. When the Empower House proposal came to us, we were delighted and intrigued by their concept. This team really stole the show back in the decathlon. And as you heard, there were big lines out. It was like this every day. And right now, when we cut this ribbon, they're going to steal our hearts. Today is a very special day. It's very exciting for me to be here. I got to see the finished product of the hard work that we got to do, all the volunteers. This project has had a major impact on my life. This project has helped me develop as a professional in many, many ways. Having our education tied to a real house that we were building was incredibly motivating. We never wanted to stop working on this as long as we knew that somebody was going to live in this house. And we really kept working until we could make something that was going to be good for this community, for these people, but that was also replicable, that was also beautiful, that was sustainable. I'm really excited. I just did a quick walk through the house and it was amazing to see um, what Happy Life Humanity has been able to do, um, be able to complete this house. It looks so much better than I could ever have imagined. What I hope people would learn from this project is that the average person can be able to live greener, that things like solar panels or producing electricity is not something only the rich can afford, but it's practical for everyone. It's a major interdisciplinary project of an extended period. Learning to work on an interdisciplinary team is a critical life skill for you know, engineers and scientists, and in fact anybody these days who wants to be effective. This project was really outside of the box. And it allowed students to work with the community, to leave their classrooms, and to enter the space where people are collaborating in the real world. My roots are right here in Washington, D.C. And when I heard about the Solar Decathlon, and really that the house was going to be put into this area of Washington, D.C., I felt it was very important that I personally should step forward. I would like to see what it's like living in this kind of house. The project with the Empower House has had a tremendous impact on Habitat for Humanity of D.C. It's now in our mission statement that we build green, affordable homes. Habitat affiliates all over the country and in fact all over the world will be able to look at this as a model. It's great to see the sometimes disparate pieces of the nonprofit community, working with the private sector, working with government. To have these partners to do this project in our community gives us the energy to do more exciting things. Green building has really become very integral in all real estate development, whether it's residential or commercial. Every project now incorporates some type of sustainability. Six months from now, and I can imagine sitting on my porch, just looking out and seeing my neighbors outside, enjoying their evening on their porches as well, and also spending time with my family outside, my children. I just can't wait to move in. I'm ready to move in now, actually. 